Hey everyone, we're gonna go and get a salad because over Memorial Day weekend, I was fully indulging in all the good foods and I need to get back on track. Today is Wednesday. So I'm gonna go get a salad. I really, really, really like the new spring asparagus salad that I shared with you guys in my last vlog. So I'm gonna get that again. I am really, 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 really being real disciplined where it's to the point where I'm like, I'm eating my own stuff and everybody else is getting something different. Like that's how strict I'm being on myself. A lot of things that I gotta just like tighten up on. Alright guys, so we are here at the Global McDonald's. I thought it would be a fun experience for Seth. They basically have a special menu where they have like different menu items from different parts of the world. And right now they're doing Arabia. So I got this chicken flatbread wrap thing. Sefton just got chicken nugget, kids meal. He kept it real simple. Um, yeah, I'm excited to see how it tastes. We also got a Oreo donut that we're gonna test out too. It's mine. But a lot of the stuff on the menu was sold out. So, but we're excited. So we're sitting outside. It's really nice today. So we decided to just sit outside. And this is the McDonald's headquarters. So. We're just waiting on them to bring our stuff out. And here it is now. Excuse me. Hi. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And do you want ketchup? Um, no ketchup. No, we're good. Okay. Thank you. All right, so that's the donuts. That Diet Coke. Comes with fries. So it's the chicken mac Arabia, and I got it with no onions. I was trying to find something that was healthy. So let's see. It's got lettuce, tomato, chicken, and then there's like some sauce on it. it smells good. Mm. It's good. I don't know if you guys can see. pretty good. Um, finish eating and then I'll come back. So, here is the Oreo. I thought donut. it was bigger than that. I thought it was going to be bigger too. So, we just going to split it. guys we are back home i uh, went for a little walk picked up some stuff for the kids from h m some shorts and t-shirts summer stuff it's so hot y'all wait a minute hold on got some coffees from nespresso and i'm trying a couple new ones today 
Well, the first one I got is the Vivita. The girl at Nespresso highly recommended this. She said this is the one that she drinks first thing in the morning. It's rich in vitamin B12 to help support immune health. So I thought I would give it a try. She said it's really good. It's really smooth. And I'm going to give this a try tomorrow. So I got that one. And then I got the Juicy Watermelon over ice now originally when i first heard of this it made me nauseous just the idea of fruit and coffee just does not sound appealing to me then my girl keiko vouched for it and i was like okay i gotta try it i gotta at least try it and because it's iced i feel like that would make a huge difference because I'm not going to be drinking this hot. I'm going to be drinking it over ice. Um, also, the girl, I'm calling her a girl, but she's a woman. The woman in the espresso, she said it was good too. And she said it's very refreshing. And so, yeah, this will be a great little iced coffee for me. I'll probably make one here soon, actually, because it's time for my afternoon pick-me-up. And then I just got the... Um, golden caramel this replaced the caramel cookie which I love which is my all-time favorite it does taste a little different but I still like it and it's kind of like a staple of mine so I want to get that and yeah those are all the coffees that I got what else it's so hot y'all so let me make my coffee Had to come on and report that this is so good and y'all i am not a big watermelon person like i like the flavor of watermelon i'm not big on actual watermelon like the texture is just a little weird to me but this this is so good all right All right, guys, so it is the next day and we are getting ready to head to the pool. I got my pool bag packed up. I'm just gonna pack some snacks. I'm gonna pack the boys some turkey sandwiches. They're very easy. They just love turkey, cheese, on wheat bread, no condiments. So make them some turkey sandwiches. Just pack up some random snacks just to have. They probably won't eat everything, but I like to have a variety. I got some frozen grapes in the freezer that I'm gonna take to just have on cup sheet, bathing suit, of course. And I'm just wearing some Zara, like drawstring. They're not linen, but they're just like little flowy pants. And I'm gonna put on my blue slides and pack this baby up. So yeah, that's what we got going on today. So let me go ahead and get this bag packed so we can hit the pool.
guys, we are back from the pool. Seth had a ball. He's actually in the shower right now. PJ wanted no parts of the pool, so it actually worked out great for me because he and I just did our pool side, had our snacks. I did some editing, which was nice. Yeah, we just had a fun time. So now we're just going to wait for Seth to get out the shower and probably go and grab some food or something. I ended up putting on this little like linen button down shirt from Zara. Just threw it on like over like this. So I'm actually gonna leave this on because we're just going to walk to get some food. So it's not a big deal. And um, yeah, so I'm just taking some of this stuff out of my bag because I am going to wear this bag but i'm gonna take some of this stuff just clean it out a little bit so it's not as heavy that'll be it so i'm thinking about once a week going to some new restaurant spots places that we haven't been before like this summer just every week just try out a new restaurant um places that we have not tried and we have tried a lot of restaurants a lot so yeah i thought it would be cool to like pick different restaurants each week and then bring you guys with us and you know just kind of expose you all to some new restaurants that we haven't tried and so we'll be like trying it out together that way if any of you are interested in traveling to chicago you'll kind of have something to refer back to because i do get questions about like different restaurants and uh, hotel recommendations here and so yeah i think that is going to be the plan for this month and then next month we'll probably do something different like maybe museums like we'll pick different museums each week and whatever i don't know we may mix it up a little bit this month we may do restaurant one week museum next week so yeah that's the plan let me know what you guys think I think it would be really cool and fun and now that it's summer if you're a mom you know during the school year everything is kind of just like on pause until school is out so like this is Septon's last week of school and so once he's out of school that will free up so much time for me and we can go out and do more stuff you know so Seth will be out of school for the summer PK will not be teaching this summer and so we'll all be like free to just kind of like do whatever and not be kind of boggled down with schedules and times and practices and games and things like that I'm excited for summer and we can kind of like get out and just do all the things and I'm excited to share it with you guys so yeah that's all i wanted to mention to you all and i'm gonna go ahead and get out of here because seth just finished up his shower and i'm starving but yeah guys thank you all so much for watching and i'll catch you on my next one bye